Well, hello again. I'm Bill Russell, President of Lake Norman Chamber of Commerce. We have another edition of Around the Lake. Today we have John McHugh, who is with OK Photography. And John, you have a very storied background. Ten years of military service on a boat uh, and a lot of corporate background. Before we get into OK, talk about how what, what you did in, in, with your career. Well, I guess the starting starting my career in the uh, going back into the Navy, I did a uh, start off on a surface ship and wound up uh, about doing six years on a uh, special project submarine out of Vallejo, California, and then uh, wound up at air traffic control schools in Memphis, Tennessee. Uh, from there, I hopped over to uh, to Washington, D.C and went to work for a company called Atex, which was in the publishing business, and uh, was working with a, uh, a submariner, an ex-submariner, and uh, part of my, you know, part of my photography business there was that uh, they knew who that I was really interested. So when I went for my interview, they held my interview with National Geographic. Oh, wow. now, yeah, the unfortunate part about that was, you know, they, they were walking me around and I, they had to drag me out of the dark room because I was drooling all over their floor. You know, I mean, it was just, uh, it was just, it was embarrassing. Uh, <laughs> but uh, I wound up there and uh, just started off working with them in technical areas, worked my way up. I was a regional service manager. Uh, and that's part of the way I knew the Carolinas because I was in and out of the Carolinas as a regional service manager. I had the entire East Coast. And then I went, uh, Went up to uh, to Boston, was up there, and there I was worked as both a uh, director of technical services for marketing and sales, and wound up being a senior manager in uh, software development. And that's kind of how I met you because when I first met you, probably 12, 13 years ago, you you yeah. were into IT. Yeah, well, I had I went from ATEX, I went to a division of Lockheed. And um, Lockheed decided that they were going to, uh, which we call consolidate all of their MIS and IT people in Boulder, Colorado. Well, I'm up in New Hampshire, and yeah, you know, they weren't offering any moves. So uh, I had uh, been doing a little outside work, and uh, I called around to a couple of my clients and said yeah, you got anything for me? And they said, yeah, we can probably keep you busy for a little while. And I said, okay, well, I've been wanting to start a business. Let's see what happens. And started that in, in the late 80s. Uh, Stasis Incorporated came about in 94. Mm -hmm. And uh, so it that held me all the way up until I was pretty much ready to retire. And I had, in the meantime, I had done several years working with Fisher Investments. I've worked with a company called Cap Terrace uh, and uh, was just, was ready to do something else. And so I got here, I became an ambassador and I went out with, uh, went out to a couple ribbon cuttings and Jack was out there with his little camera trying to take <laughs> yeah, and, and, and I said, I, I think I can help. And so I, I did a couple of ribbon cuttings and then we had a uh, ambassador meeting and I found out the term voluntold. <laughs> and I was voluntold that I was now the official photographer for the Chamber of Commerce. How many, uh, how many okay. pictures do you think, because when you do a ribbon cutting with us, generally there might be 60, 70 pictures that you take. How many pictures do you think are up in the clouds, this Lake Norman Chamber Thousands and thousands. Well, figure from 2011 through now and probably 70 or so events a year and, uh, and, and 50 to 100 pictures a piece. Uh, there's probably a few. Yeah. <laughs> well, it's always really good, high quality work. You, you, uh, you are the person who has been very gracious with your time. Uh, doing ribbon cutting pictures and business mixers and after hours and and banquets and uh, just uh, you know you really tell the chamber's story and I, I want to thank you for that 
Um, and I really also want to thank you for your service to our country uh, aboard the uh, submarine. Um, let me ask you a question, John. What do you like most about living and working in the Lake Norman region? Oh, well, people. I mean, that's, that's, that, that, one's, that one's an easy one. Uh, we have had more friends and acquaintances here than uh, any other place that I've lived, and I've lived a lot of places. Uh, I've lived in nine states and multiple places of those states, and they go from San Diego to Seattle to Boston down to Florida. So, uh, you know, there, and points in between. <laughs> uh, Memphis, Chicago, uh, Denver, and I actually grew up a little town in Colorado, in the, in the southern end of Colorado, in Trinidad. So... Another question for you. What do you think is the most memorable uh, photography shoot you ever went on? Yes, I was, I was thinking about and and I think I know the one. It's uh I was working with the ARC people, the people that do the uh the autistic children. Uh -huh. And they set up this thing with the airport where they were a family would bring in their child. And child or children in some cases and they would go through the entire process of buying their ticket going through tsa getting on the plane you know waiting in line to get on the plane and, and doing all of the things that a normal person would do who's traveling through the airport and it was absolutely amazing and we the uh the kids behaved i think there was one kid that got a little rowdy, but other than that they they did everything fine uh and but the, one of the funniest things was is there was a uh a group there that had service dogs uh -huh. and one of the service dogs was a great dane well i kept i accompanied the people onto the plane where they were going to be taxiing around and uh Somehow I wound up in the row with the person who had the Great Dane and I wound up with the Great Dane in my lap for, <laughs> a, part of the, for a part of the flight. Uh, it was a really interesting, uh, they, they taxied around, they did a water cannon salute. Uh, the kids really enjoyed it. They had several local celebrities there talking to the kids and talking to the people. And uh, it was just, that was probably the one event that really stuck with me. Let's get back to your photography. What's the market area that you really cover for OK? Uh, essentially, I cover Charlotte up to, which we call it, up to Troutman, I guess. Uh, I've done, uh, most of my work is done in, obviously, in Cornelius, Hartsonville, and Davidson. Um, among the official places, I, I, I'm with the chamber and the uh, Davidson community players. I've mm -hmm. done all that for right. the past many years, uh, but ad hoc, I do whatever work any, any of the organizations, if somebody has a need, I'll, I'll work with them. Pretty much you cover anything, but weddings, that, because that's pretty a specialty. Oh you know, yeah. You know? Wedding, weddings is, are, they're tough. They, there's too much individual specialized work that goes into them. And I'm, I enjoy having a little bit more fun. <laughs> I mean, I can shoot for a day, uh, do whatever is necessary and have have people have their pictures and stuff in a couple of days and, and then and it's over with. I've seen people go eight to 10 days of work on a, a wedding and I just don't want that kind of left, kind of, kind of uh, load. So... Well, we really appreciate uh, not only your service to the country and your service to the Chamber of Commerce, but everything you do for organizations like the Davidson Community Players. I, I can't thank you enough for, for, for everything that you've done and helping us tell our story for the Chamber. Yeah. yeah in terms of what I do anymore, I mean, uh, Ocade came, uh, uh, the name Ocade came out of event photography. And that's sort of how I got started here in the uh, area with the chamber and the Davidson community players. Uh, since then, I've kind of graduated over to the, to the artwork you kind of see behind me here. This is my Lake Norman collection. Uh, you've seen some of my work. I, get, I gave you a copy of the Hugh Torrance house mm -hmm. and we have some of the stuff's on display there at uh, visit Lake Norman. So 
Uh, this is where this is where my passion is going these days. But uh, I'm still out there taking pictures of events, and uh, we'll we'll be doing a whole bunch this year, I'm sure. Well, John, we appreciate everything you do. We appreciate Joe Vagnone. He's a local business broker, and he's a presenting sponsor of our Around the Lake series. So, John, thank you for taking the time to explain a little bit about you, what you do, but also for the tremendous service that you do for the Chamber of Commerce. Well, I thank you and uh, look forward to seeing what's going on here. Thank you, John. Bye-bye. Okay.